I don't mean to be rude or discourteous, but before we begin, I'd just like to say that there is absolutely no scientific evidence to support clairvoyance of any kind. It, which means, and again, no insult intended, but you're a fraud. <laughs> Your profession is a swindle, and uh, your livelihood is dependent on the gullibility of stupid people. <laughs> but again, no offense. All right, Sheldon, just ask your question. <clears throat> okay, I just did. What was it? Oh, for God's sake, look, he's a physicist who's trying to figure out what his next field of study should be. For your information, I was asking her about the next Star Trek movie. <laughs> I can answer that one. I'll be bored. <laughs> All right. Why don't we begin? <sighs> your spirit guides are telling me that there's a woman in your life you're having problems with. That's an easy guess. I'm clearly an annoying person. I have problems with both genders. <laughs> yes, you clearly are. <laughs> But I'm seeing a specific woman that you're in a romantic relationship with. Oh, oh, here we go. Does she have dark hair? Yes, yes, your spirit guides are on fire. The majority of people have dark hair, even you at one time. Does she work in a similar field to you? Yeah, ha, the opposite. She's a neurobiologist and I'm a theoretical physicist. My spirit guides can go suck an egg. They're telling me that you have difficulty being close with her. Oh, he does. He so does. What should he do? He should give himself to this relationship. Once he does, all his other pursuits will come into focus. Sheldon, do you hear that? I mean, Amy is the key to your happiness. Exactly. Personally and professionally, everything will fall into place once you commit to her. You know what this is? Yeah, and I reserve this word for those rare instances when it's truly deserved. This is malarkey. Wow, he really struck a nerve. I've never heard him use the M word before. 